Clinical Signs – The Red Flags Diagnosing diabetes often starts the moment the owner walks in the door and describes the classic signs. In both dogs and cats, we look for the four Ps. Polyuria, or PU, which is excessive urination. Polydipsia, or PD, which is excessive drinking. Polyphagia, a ravenous appetite. And weight loss, losing weight despite that ravenous appetite. That specific combination, eating everything in sight but still losing weight, is the hallmark of diabetes. It signifies that the body is literally breaking down its own muscle and fat reserves because it cannot access glucose. You will also often see a poor, unkempt coat and general lethargy because the animal is chronically energy deprived. While the core signs are the same, dogs and cats have their own unique tells. In dogs, the most common and devastating complication is cataracts. High blood sugar drives glucose into the lens of the eye, where it traps water and causes the lens fibers to rupture. This happens fast, sometimes overnight, and leads to total blindness. If an owner reports their dog is suddenly bumping into furniture, check the blood sugar immediately. In cats, we look at their legs. Diabetic cats can develop a condition called diabetic neuropathy. The high glucose damages the nerves, leading to a plantigrade stance. Instead of walking on their toes like normal, they drop down and walk on their hocks, or heels. It looks like a rabbit hopping. We also see a shift from obesity in the early stages to severe muscle wasting along the spine as the disease progresses.